So is it acceptable? He's fine. But there are some better picks. When should you look to use Alexstrasza's trade? Anytime you fight over something meaningful. Or if there's going to be a meaningful conclusion to the fight that neither team looks willing to give up. So, what is meaningful? Boss fight, objective fight, my fort, your fort, my keep, your keep, my core, your core. Like I said, boss fight and objective. And then, random meaningless fight in lane that no team is going to be willing to give up because people dropped low. That is the fight that no one should have been having, except the winner, obviously. But if you see that no team will give it up, Dragon Queen also okay. Should you ever engage with Butcher without your completed quest? Yes. If you are with superior odds, you should never charge without completed quests with Butcher I into a fight that's 4v4, 3v3, 2v2 or 1-on-1. On one. But you should take every 4v3, 3v2, 2v1, 1v0, 5v4. Realm needs me. Oh no, Celia's Ming. This guy only doesn't play Spectrum. Cool skin. The Double D says, I just played a game we had Varian and Zarya. And I played Tracer, and I did okay. Varian went Colossal Smash, not Taunt. Am I wrong to say that we had no front line? And that's why we lost? We had Varian and Zarya. When well, you have a front line, but... You have no hard CC, right? He should be on Taunt, basically, with that comp. But what did the opponent have? Because I don't have the full picture. Bizaley says, I just had two people first pick Jogal in Master Hero League. <laughs> Enemy picked Karazim, Malthiel, Tychus. He then had the cheek to say he was reporting me because I picked Abba. Because why the hell not if he trolled me? You rage picked. You can't deny it. No matter how wrong your allies are, you still rage picked and you hurt yourself in the process out of spitefulness. I 100% get it. No one will ever be 100% angelic, right? But you did rage pick because I don't think you really believed that was the best. Still, he, ra he, he trolled you first, right? So you can do blood for blood or you can do your best. I usually tried to do my best, but I remember one time in my life I picked Kerrigan mass mana talents on a no support, no tank draft because I was angry at the picks. Uh, let's see. Hmm. Would this be good? I think so. For action. Let the games begin. I will force of will people that get comboed by these three. Oh, this is my jail. Does my Yev hard counter Illidan? <laughs> uh, not with every part of her kit. 
No, I wouldn't say so. She has some tricks against him, yes. But she doesn't hard counter him straight up. Does Rainer counter Illidan? Not quite, but at level 16 with double Q, 13, 16 stun. Uh, he can be quite good against Illidan nonetheless. Great, it's you. Remember, Ark. Yeah, that's true what the Hydra says. Does Illidan counter Illidan? The answer is yes, most Illidan counter themselves. <laughs> Nice question, Jazzarm. I think you know the answer. Medivh copy for some fun interactive gameplay. <laughs> what, what are you talking about? Let the battle begin. All right, guys. I need to focus. I'm playing a easy character. Talent. Dust of appearance. Oh, maybe that was not the best. That's all five. No quest stacks lost yet, so it was the last acceptable time.
tired of your petty squabbling. Gather tribute. Earn my favor. You will not stand in my way. I will endeavor to return the favor. I go our arcane explosion from Muradin. Uh, I don't think Master's Touch will make me play this game any better. No, your team never lacks any damage with two specs when you have Grey Main Abathur. I think people underestimate Grey Main's damage when properly empowered. Why no quests? Because it's not that easy to complete on Cursed Hollow quests. And uh, Arcane Explosion, if the numbers were a little better, actually has a really good functionality. Arcane Explosion does 282 damage. It's definitely a better early game talent. Abathur's early game is his weak point. I think it's a great choice. For the map, for the comp. And Murden is a great... Uh, how to say? Punching bag. Gather tribute or face my curse. The choice is simple. Onward. I will deal with you myself. Great job. This is a good grey main. I wish I was better at grey main right now. Then that happened, but he lived. It's fine. Oh, oh, that's just a copy. I see vision. 
We didn't grab the tribute and we continued to dive. That was a bit... That was a bit meh. And the Haka's gonna burrow. Really, uh, not a good dive. We could have had them cursed. Time to make my retreat. I will set things right. <laughs> it's not me. It's Mira. <laughs> That's all four of them. Could steal it with Leyline. Probably not worth it. Oh, hello. My curse upon you. You've been training. I am low on mana. It is time to act. There hey, is much. That was our port. Reabsorption. I will use this well. For Azeroth. For the sake of our future. <laughs> and so the curse ends. Perhaps now you will. It's value, yes. That's good. Overall, quite good. <laughs> Your time My is for the sake of our future. Oh, well, yes, the bonus auto attack speed. Yeah, I didn't go for stacks. I went for Arcade Explosion. I think it's actually really good. Um, when you are against such a threatening comp, you really need to mind your positioning. If you go Master's Touch on one, a big map like Cursed Hollow War at Junction, you're playing the game wrong uh, to a degree. At least in Hero League, like, if you're god, like super insane godlike, it's like, okay, whatever, it's fine. Uh, also, Arcane Explosion on Muradin is really good. It is time to act. Funny thing is, when he casts Isolation, if you leyline him in the animation, it will still happen post leyline. So, you do need to dodge it though. Excelsior. Of course. He didn't believe my bluff. I grow tired of your petty squabbling. Gather tribute. Earn your favor. You're holding back. Oh, 
Oh, we don't need to go Korra. Huh? Okay, maybe we will. I love this game. My magic wasted enough of my time. Oops. Maybe that's a bit too too monkey. Nice. Look, we got good damage in. And I think Arcane Explosion does more. Probably the Master's Touch this game. MVP. Yeah. That's a good one for you too. Because we, we never... This is a, he really was a great Grey Mane. Got carried a bit, I must say. If this Grey Mane was like... Either very shy... Or not very mechanically sound. We We have a lot of... You know, hope riding on him. I thank you. I don't have a lot of money, but I love you, your channel and community. You've taught I and others so much about the game and life in general. Lyrica Grubble. Harbinger 3. <laughs> I'm glad. I'm glad to be your second dad. Thank you very much. Uh, so I had Stable Portal with Quickening, I had Arcane Explosion, Dust of Appearance, Leyline, Re Reabsorption, and I didn't really think about 20, but if you're going Coral in, Arcane Brilliance will do the most, Greetings so spread. I took it. It makes sense under the circumstances. 